much. Ben and seven twelve eighty seven back again. Nit is time. I'm Johnny Gilford. Nit is time for game eighteen. Before we start our game, at the third one that's Jeopardy two thousand three for the PC. So far in seventeen games, are you ready for this total? One million three hundred twenty one thousand two hundred dollars. And I got Eugene Chapin Aubrey. Normal game? Okay, so how many people out there? One. Player one? Player one, here's your buzz in key. It's showtime. From the Sony Pictures Studios, Hi. this is Jeopardy. Here he is, the host of Jeopardy, Alex Trebek. Thank you, Johnny, and welcome, everyone, to another exciting game of Jeopardy. The first round categories are as follows. Kick it. This president's first lady. Oh, yeah. Dash A, dash A, dash A. <laughs> Tense in the Bible. Tense in the Bible? Stupid answers. <gasps> oh! TV drama. And our last category. Oh, Aubrey. Capital City. Stupid answers. All right, let's get things underway, player one. Oh, one moment. All right, here we go. Player one, you choose. Okay, right, I got it. TV drama two. Della Reese has won many oh, NAACP okay. Image Awards as outstanding lead actress for playing Tess on this series. Player one. What is touched by an angel? Exactly. TV drama for four. In 1994-95, this medical series finished second in the ratings, the highest ever for a first-year drama series. Player one. What is ER? Definitely. TV drama six. 
Subtitled Life on the Streets, this NBC crime drama was executive produced by film director Barry Levinson. Anyone? What we were looking for is Homicide the... Life on the Street. 800. Tom Hanks was the executive producer of this 1998 HBO miniseries about the Apollo space program. Player two? What is from the Earth to the Moon? Yes. All from the Earth to the Moon was the... Let's try tough capital cities for 200. Really? Managua. Managua? Player two? What is Nicaragua? Where are I for you to chat when you need them? Precisely. Pick again. Oh, Nicaragua. Tough capital cities for 400. Dhaka. Dhaka. Bangladesh. What is Bangladesh? I got it. Correct. You certainly know your geography. Tough capital cities for 600. Nicosia. <laughs> this is the correct question. Cyprus. <laughs> Tough capital cities for 800. Colombo. Player one. Sri Lanka. Hey, you're correct. Oh my god. We got the space and we got it. <laughs> Finish that TV drama a thousand. Player one, you too. This three letter CBS series concerns Navy lawyers. Yeah. Player one. I knew that one. Exactly. Finish a uh, <laughs> tough capital city for a thousand. Valletta. What is. Nobody? Player three. What is Bulgaria? Good guess. Mm -hmm. But it's not what we're looking for. Malta? Yes, what is Malta? Player one. Malta? Yeah. Enter. That's the spot exactly. <laughs> Oh, that's my multi. Uh, A, 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 for two. Ecuador is the world's largest exporter of this fruit's Cavendish species. What's a banana? One. Papaya! <gasps> Precisely. Oh. Pick again. It is banana. Wow. Oh, cause this, no, papaya is something one, else. Banana oh. is the largest. Hats uh -oh. off to this country between Costa what Rica Panama? and Colombia. Player one. Panama. Definitely. Van Halen, 600. Answer? Oh, Daily Double. Daily Double. I love it. Uh -huh. Did you make your wager, please? From Spanish for hut, it's a little shelter that opens onto a swimming pool. Player one. Here's Cabana. C. <laughs> a. E for Ben. Precisely. Woo! Pick again. What second? 8,000. Hotel chains include Days Inn, Howard what is Ramadan? and this end. Player one. M-A-D-A? 
That's the only one I know of. Definitely. Finish. A famous Holy Land fortress of 73 A.D. Uh -oh. I'm not going there. All? This is what we wanted. Masada. That's why I'm not gonna go there because I didn't know about this. This president's Player first one, lady two. for two. Barbara. Who is George Herbert Walker Bush? Yeah. Hey, you're correct. She got to the punch. But she's still in a hole. This president's first lady for 400. Mamie. Who's Dwight David Eisenhower? Daughter, Ian. There you go. Who's Dwight Eisenhower? Precisely. Pick again. Six. Rosalind. Who's Carter? Player one. Carter. James Earl Carter. He's the one we were looking for. Yes. Eight. Reagan. Oh, how did you know? Player one. Are you eight? There you go. Precisely. <laughs> Again. I. I. If it's this president's first lady, if it's the next to last, it has to be Reagan. Betty. Who's Ford? Ford. Bill Ford. Definitely. Oh. You know what? I'd say stupid answers for us. Get rid of the Bible. Bible first for two. According to Genesis chapter 13, verse 12, Lot pitched his tent what is for of? this city near Gomorrah. Player one. What is what? S O D O M. Oh. Exactly. Tent for four. Numbers chapter 19, verse 14 says if a man dieth in his tent, everything in it and all who enter. Are unclean for this three days. Player two, what is seven? Mm. Definitely. Let's go for stupid answers. For two hundred? Uh. In nineteen sixty-eight, sixty-nine, Liechtenstein is honoring prominent collectors of these. What are stamps? Player two, what are stamps? <laughs> Precisely. Pick again. Beat to the punch. Stupid answers. For 400. Matt Damon played this character in Good Will With Will Hunting. With Will Hunting. Hunting. Hey, you're correct. Tent six. This apostle from Tarsus was a tent maker by trade. Player three. Who is Saul? Exactly. Oh. Tents in the Bible. For Thank you. When asked, where is Sarah thy wife? He replied, in the Who's tent. Abraham? Player two? Who is Abraham? You asshole. That's who we were looking for. How about stupid answers for 600? Oh, she's gonna go back there. The first two words of the French Bundle Canada. Canadian National Anthem. Player one. Beat you to the punch. Was all Canada. Precisely. Pick again. Tense five thousand finish. His son Ham discovered this ark builder Who's no naked in his tent. Naked? Oh god. Oh my. He's the one we were looking for. Yes. Ah, we don't want to go there with a ten foot Paul. Stupid answers eight. After Mexico, it's the most populous country whose official language yes, is Spanish. Anya, what is Spain? Player one. Spain? Precisely. Again. I think the biggest nightmare would be seeing old dirty bingo naked. 
In 1981, this nine-letter word was added to the state flag. What is Wisconsin? <laughs> it's Wisconsin, of course. Exactly. Fifteen six. Hey, you're in that category. Okay, that's right it up. for the Jeopardy round. Now we're going to take a quick look at the scores. You're building up a huge lead, player one. Player two, you're not too far off the lead. You're in last place, player three, but you get to start things off in double Jeopardy. Let's pick it up, double Jeopardy. Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time for double Jeopardy. Here are the categories for the double Jeopardy round. Give us some good ones. The Wright Brothers. Christmas Cuisine. Teddy Roosevelt. Wow. Historic People. Okay. Beastly Expression. And oh, probably this uh, year for Cat Boy. Walk and Pop. Walk and Pop. I know Christmas came up. I'm like, oh, this is the right time for this. Historic People for 400. Here we go. In 1890, at age six, this president and his family moved to... Who is Harry Truman? Well, who is Truman? Definitely. At least it's not Harry F. Truman. You might. 800. Thank you, Thank you George D.K. Chester Dick. was the last of three men to serve as president Who is Chester A. Arthur? Chester oh. Allen Arthur. Who is Chester Yeah. Exactly. What? One last three was the president. 1200. A host to break the bank. Oh, God. As the former singing host of the Miss America pageant. Player one. It was Gene Wayburn? That no. Is incorrect. Nobody? Not Tom Kelly. Uh, Take a look. Here's the right response. Bart. Oh. Oh, they want the other verse of break the. No, wait a minute. Hold on. Time out. Time out. Break the bank was the original host the first half of the season. No, first half. Uh, that seat was hosted by Gene Rayburn. Okay, we got that. So, but Parks took over for the rest of the seasons. Break the bank. Okay. Now I got my facts right. Historic People 16. Roger the Second, king of this large island off Italy. Was one of what the is Sicily? Intellectual dynamos. Player one. I see. I L Y. Exactly. Two thousand. The conspirators no. against this Roman dictator were wounded by each other. Who is Julius Caesar? BC. Player one. They want to be more specific. More explicit, please. Okay. Julius. Who is Julius Caesar? Definitely. I forgot. There is that part. Walk and pop four. It was the Hold on. decade in which Cher didn't have a top forty hit. Player Seventy. Four. What is the nineteen fifties? Exactly. Oh, the nineties. Oh, I forgot. Do you believe? Hold on one moment. <laughs>
Alright. Okay, sorry about that. Walk a pop fall. Oh no, his pick, huh? Rock and pop for eight hundred. We went for that. Of a steamroller, <laughs> airplane, or two U.S. cities, it was what the group Buffalo Springfield was named after. Player one. Oh shoot. Chicago? Good answer, but sorry. That's wrong. Player three. What is an airplane? Good answer, but sorry. That's wrong. No, what a, what a city! Anyone? Chicago is not an option. <laughs> what we were looking for was no, this. No, it's Steamroller. Let's try Christmas Cuisine. For 400. There you go. During the holidays, time. Winter White Chocolate is one what of the Robin? Of this chain's 31 flavors. Player one. That's Baskin Robin. Exactly. Walk and pop for trial. Let's try again. Melissa Joan Hart's mother took her name from a song by this band featuring Duane and Greg. Player two? What is the Almond Brothers band? No. Oh, Definitely. yeah. Oh, yeah. Player three. Rock and pop for 1600. He reached new heights with purple. Who's Prince? It's Prince. Oh, the artist formerly known as Prince. Exactly. Finished. In 1982, it was business as usual. What's at work? Who can it be now, group from down under? Player one. Man at work. Ding. That is that. That's who we were looking for. Since when? Since when the holiday spirit? Christmas cuisine for eight. And we wish you a merry Christmas, Carolers. What's the money? And won't go until they get some. Player one. Something's precisely. Oh, I could get left mind. Twelve. About one point seven six billion of these striped canes hmm? are what a cane. us every year. Most of them are used for decoration. Player one. Candy canes. Hey, you're correct. Like it to get to the point instant now. Won't advise you to do that for Christmas, thank you. It's an English tradition to adorn this tusked animal's head with sprigs of bay, roses, oh. and little flags. Player three. Oh, it. What is pig? Exactly. Oh, pigs. Let's go for Teddy Roosevelt. I for hope it's not much picky. In 1898, Roosevelt resigned as Assistant Secretary of the Navy. One of the Rough Riders? ...organized this cavalry unit. Player one. One of the Rough Riders? Hey, you're correct. It really looks to be a category. Yeah, it does. Christmas, yeah. you'll have a burning desire... One of the Log. ...to Noel, a cake shaped like this. What's the Log? Player one. Oh, Exactly. If no <laughs> Daily Double is on the Teddy Wilson out, by the way, we know where the Daily Doubles are. Player one, you so We got a better shot at winning back. Roosevelt was famous for saying, Speak softly, was but a big stick. This. Player was one. A big stick. That's a big stick. Yes. Not a big dick. You my five hundred. Ah, big enough a daily double. Which one of them? Make your wager, please. Well, carpe idea. Could you make your wager, please? Roosevelt was only forty-two when he succeeded this man as president. Who is McKinley? One. Player one. 
who is William <laughs> McKinley. Precisely. Pick again. 1600. Roosevelt, who often participated in this sport, was virtually blinded in his left eye during a match. Player one. That's hunting? The only one I can think of. No. No, sorry. Archery. Anybody? Player two? What is boxing? Yes. Oh, boxing. That's for... Okay. Okay. Beastly expressions for 400. The correct response should roll off your tongue like water off this... What is it, What's Player it? one. Crack. Precisely. Pick again. Finish up once about two. In 1904, God, as a candidate for this new party, Roosevelt lost his third bid for president. Player two? What is Bull Moose? Bull Moose? Yes. Oh. oh the Wright Brothers for 400. That's okay. The last name of leave. teachers Wilhelm and Jacob. What is Grim? Tales out of school. Player one. What is Grim? E R I L M. That is exactly bingo. Uh, basically expresses for eight. If you receive a horse as a gift, never look at it. What is in the mouth? Player three. What is the mouth? Ah, definitely. Beat to the punch. Beastly expressions for one thousand two hundred. Oh no. These farm animals may fly, but they are very unlikely birds. What are player one? Oh, chickens. Nice try, but that is not rooster. Correct. Player two? What are pigs? Precisely. Oh. Pick again. When pigs Let's go fly. the Wright brothers. For eight what? The younger brother of novelist Heinrich Mann, he wrote Joseph and his brothers. Player two? Who is Thomas uh, Mann? Uh, That's who we were looking for. The Wright Brothers. For 1,200? Oh, that was the final daily double. He has to go a whole win. Yep. If he goes it up, we got a great shot. The son author, Alec, and the loved one author, Evelyn. I would never have gotten that one. What is Wa? Exactly. Oh, he's got it. The Wright Brothers for 1600. His letters were edited and published with a memoir in 1966 by his brother W. H. Lewis. Player one. Who is C. S. Lewis? C. <laughs> yes. Yes. Phyllis of White Brothers for two. In this family, William wrote Human Immortality and his brother Henry, The Ambassadors. Player two? What is James? Uh, exactly. William and Henry James. Give me course. beastly expressions Damn. for 1600. You might as well be hanged what is as one of these. No. Player three. What is a lamb? Definitely. Oh, they want the other one. And to wrap up this board, oh, okay. don't mistake an old one of these for a preacher because of his beard. Player three. What is a goat? Oh. Definitely. Don't mistake an old goat because of goats have That's beard. The end of the double jeopardy round. That the makes sense. Player one, you've got the lead going 54 into final eight. Game. Player two, you're not too far um, off It's going lead. all in will be what? $109,600. Final Jeopardy time. Once I give you the category, you'll yeah. have just a few seconds to decide on okay, your Okay, what's the final Jeopardy category? Halloween TV. Ugh, a nightmare before Christmas, really? Go ahead, make your wager. Greg Cripps was in it. Player three, could we have your wager, please? 
Player two, your wager, please. Player one, please make your wager. So, 196? Yeah. Here's the final Jeopardy answer. Good luck. Mythical Damn. being in the title of the oft-repeated animated TV special that debuted October 27th, 1966. Oh, good grief. Who is the great pumpkin? Let's see how everyone did. Player three. The Headless <laughs> Horseman? Sorry. That's wrong. That's Thomas incorrect. Player two, your question. Sorry, that's wrong. That better be Thomas the great Kiedekowski. pumpkin. Your question, player one. That's correct. What did you wait for? All of it, baby. Oh my god. Good grief, it is. The great pumpkin telling Congratulations to our big winner. 109,600. Player one. <laughs> Yeah, that's still a big Thanks for playing yeah, Jeopardy. Right Come back and see us again real soon, won't you? Hi, folks. I'm Johnny Six. Green. Let's just get a few details out of the way before we start our Too bad that 69 can reverse, so I'll make it 169. Oh, my. Make you team K. Well, we got stuck with the peanuts, evidently. Of 109,600. Oh, well, let's get a place blocked, <laughs> Simply because we're the ones who took the football away from them. <laughs> oh, but you want to make a total of it, too, because we are nearly at a really good point, too. One million. Four hundred thirty thousand eight hundred dollars. That's not bad. So we're nearly at one and a half million. Well, we need at least sixty-nine thousand more to crack it. You my. Thank you, George. So there you go. That is Jeopardy for the Jeopardy 2003 PC. I'd like to thank the guys for being part of it. Up and out. Thank you all for watching. See you next video soon.